I don't know. Can you tell me something? Antelopes are warm-blooded animals. They have a backbone or a spine, just like us humans. They have hair or fur. They give birth to their young and give them milk to live well. This is what makes them mammals. Can you say mammal? Mammal! Good! Antelopes can be found in Africa, North America, Asia, and the Middle East. There are 90 different types of antelopes living in grasslands, woodlands, savannas, deserts, plains, and swamps. See those eyes? These are the one of the many features that helps antelopes to survive. They have hooves split into two toes, both for walking and climbing. Antelopes try to get away from animals such as lions, crocodiles, pythons, and hyenas. Antelopes are smart in finding food. In a grassland, you may see antelopes following zebras, so the antelopes can eat the softer part of the grass. Some antelopes have spiraled horns. These type of antelopes are called the kudu. Horns can grow as tall as five feet. Antelopes are usually found in groups called herds. Can you say herd? Herd! Antelopes only eat plants, seeds, and grass because this is how they get their energy. This is what makes them a herbivore. Can you say herbivore? Herbivore. Just like antelopes, us human beings like to eat plants too, such as lettuce, spinach, cabbage, collard greens, and beets. 
Baby antelopes are called cows. The bucks fight with their horns and calves are formed by bucks and does. On average, they live 10 years in the wild and 20 years outside the wild. Here's a fun fact. The impala antelope is the second fastest mammal. The first fastest is the cheetah. Most female antelopes don't have horns and all male antelopes have horns. Antelopes make many sounds such as What other animal do you know makes the moo sound? Make sure you comment and please remember to click the subscribe button right below. Okay, pals. What of a daddy day is family. A family is a group of people that's made up of a parent or parents with a child or children. Sometimes family is a group not related to us by blood. Aye, who's in your family? Mommy, daddy, brother, and baby. Wow, a really young lot about antelopes. Hey, mommy, maybe birds. Birds? Yes. What about birds? Uh, but I'm going to fly away. Hey, hey, I'm back to here. Hey, I'm back to here. We're going to trace A. Yes. Uppercase A and lowercase A. Now we're going to write capital A. When your child is starting to write a letter, a number, or words of choice, depending on your child's level, it is best to have a printed tracing worksheet of your choice. One I will step. leave in the description box the letter A for your child to trace. Step. If you happen to not have a printer at home or you're not able to gain access to your local library, the other option of material is a laptop. Please and you step. can put a blank white sheet of paper over the laptop lightly and trace lightly. You do not want to damage your screen. Apple Mango Tangerine Kiwi Which fruit has the ah sound? Ah Ah we Replay play. And listen. listen That's correct Apple Level 2 Broccoli Cauliflower Asparagus Eggplant Which vegetable has the uh sound? Uh Uh We Replay, play. And listen. listen Right, it's asparagus Asparagus Level 3 Corn Romaine lettuce Potato Onion. Which vegetables have the A sound? A. We Replay play. and listen. listen. You're right. Potato and romaine lettuce. Now we're going to write lowercase a. Okay. One step. Two step.
One step. Two step. There are three steps to writing capital A. Capital A. Three steps. No case A. Two step. You're right. There are two steps for lowercase a. On the next episode, A, B. Can you guess what animal that begins with B we'll be talking about today? Z. Z. Wait, wait, wait. Let's save the rest for our pals. Remember to subscribe. Happy birthday! But the comment. Comments? Just Yo. for your support, IA will give you a nice happy birthday shout out on the next episode. Once you subscribe, let IA shout you out in the next episode and wish you a happy birthday. Thank you for watching. See you next time.